The cards today reveal a situation that is both complicated and deeply emotional. It involves your partner and another person who has recently entered their life. This third person has, for some reason, made a strong impression on your partner. What started off as a simple connection has grown unexpectedly fast between them. The cards show that they've been spending more and more time together, and now, in a surprising turn of events, they are planning to get married next week. This has all happened very quickly, leaving feelings of confusion, disbelief, and heartbreak behind. It seems so sudden and hard to believe that your partner could form such a close bond with someone else in such a short time. The energy in the cards reflects your emotional turmoil and the pain of seeing something you did not expect. You're likely questioning what happened, how it happened so fast, and why this person is now so important to your partner. But the cards also bring up another question, is this sudden closeness between your partner and this other person truly what it appears to be? Could it be that the connection between them is not as deep as it looks? The situation feels confusing, and the speed of everything happening makes it seem even more puzzling. The cards suggest that while your partner may have been swept away by the newness and excitement of this other person, it's important to question if their bond is built on something real or if it's more of an illusion. Now, as we look deeper into the cards, the question arises, is this third person actually better for your partner than you? The cards don't give a simple answer, are you ready for this? When we look more closely at the cards, they do not show this person being a better match for your partner in terms of love or compatibility. In reality, the cards reveal that this third person isn't any more special than anyone else your partner could have encountered. They don't possess any unique qualities or deep connection with your partner that would make them a better fit. However, the cards do reveal something important about why this person stands out to your partner. It's not about love or genuine compatibility, but rather about manipulation. This third party has a way of twisting situations in their favor. The cards suggest that they are skilled in creating illusions, making themselves appear as the perfect choice for your partner. They have cleverly tapped into your partner's desires, hopes, and even insecurities, using these vulnerabilities to their advantage. Instead of a real, deep connection, this person is feeding your partner what they want to hear or feel at the moment. What makes this person different from you is not that they are better suited for your partner but that they have been able to play into your partner's emotional weaknesses. They have created an environment where your partner feels special, important, and understood. In doing so, they've gained your partner's attention and affection. Your partner is unfortunately falling for this, unable to see through the manipulation. The connection they believe they have with this person is based on a carefully crafted illusion, not on genuine love or mutual respect. What this person has done differently than you is that they've tailored their approach to fit what your partner is currently craving, whether it be emotional validation, attention, or even excitement. They've been able to give your partner a sense of fulfillment, but only on a superficial level. Now let's talk about what she did better than you that has attracted your partner. What is this little thing that has set the third party apart from you? The cards reveal that this person has done something different, something subtle but incredibly powerful. 
They've provided your partner with a sense of admiration that your partner may not have fully experienced with you. It's not about something big or obvious, but rather a small, yet impactful, gesture that has made your partner feel seen in a different way. Whether it's through flattery, extra attention, or simply being at the right place at the right time, this person has managed to make your partner feel special. They've given your partner the impression that they can offer something new and unique, something that hasn't been fully experienced before. It's not that this third party has something genuinely better to offer, it's more about how they've presented themselves and played into your partner's emotions. This sense of admiration or validation that they've provided is something that has resonated deeply with your partner. Maybe they've complimented your partner in a way that made them feel appreciated, or perhaps they've offered a sense of excitement or newness that your partner was seeking. Whatever it is, this person has made your partner believe that they are offering something different, something that stands out. But remember, the cards are clear that this attraction is based on surface-level charm. It's not about a real, lasting connection or love. What this person is offering is more of an illusion, a temporary feeling of admiration and excitement that has caught your partner's attention. While it may feel strong right now, it's not built on a deep emotional connection like the one you've worked to build with your partner. The cards suggest that this admiration is fleeting, it's like a shiny object that looks attractive in the moment but doesn't hold any real value over time. The third party has swayed your partner's heart for now, but the connection they've built is based more on charm and timing than on true compatibility or love. What this person has done differently is offer your partner a brief feeling of being admired, but it's not something that can replace the deep bond you share. Let's take a moment to talk about your finances. You've been very generous, always giving to others and helping out when needed, but in doing so, you've been neglecting your own financial needs. It's wonderful to be giving, but the cards show that it's now time to focus on receiving. You deserve to allow abundance to flow into your life just as much as you've been letting it flow out. It's important to understand that not everyone is going to take advantage of your generosity. There are people who genuinely care for you and want to see you succeed and it's okay to trust that you deserve financial support when you need it. The universe, or spirit, is offering you many blessings, but to benefit from them, you must be open and willing to accept them. Sometimes, it's easy to focus only on giving, but receiving is just as important for maintaining balance in your life, especially when it comes to your finances. If you feel like your financial situation is chaotic right now, don't worry too much. The cards are showing that things are being rearranged for your ultimate benefit. It may seem confusing at the moment, but know that everything is falling into place to create a better financial future for you. This is a time to have faith and trust in the universe's plan. Even when it feels like things are out of control, spirit is working behind the scenes to align opportunities for your financial prosperity. It's crucial to believe that good things are coming your way and that you are fully deserving of financial stability and success. It's also a reminder that both giving and receiving are essential for financial balance. 
Just as you've been generous with others, it's time to allow yourself to receive abundance. You deserve to be on the receiving end of good fortune, just as much as anyone else. By embracing this flow of giving and receiving, you will create a more balanced and prosperous financial situation for yourself. Remember, spirit is working in your favor, you have been giving from the heart, and now it's time for the universe to return that kindness. Have faith in the process and trust that your financial future is bright. Allow yourself to receive the abundance you deserve and know that you are worthy of financial stability and success.